Part two of today's Local 6 Legal Line with Kevin Shannon of the Bryan Law Center answering your personal injury questions at one 8646 A question from o, uh, LoJ will uh, lead us off. Almost misread that there. She got injured in Illinois, was treated in Kentucky. Is the statute of limitations different for that? Yeah, uh, e each state will have um, different statutes of limitation and uh, the, the length of the statute of limitation will depend upon what type of claim it is and uh, and that's true across the country uh, all uh, 50 states and you'll have uh, literally hundreds of different statutes of limitation for uh, different types of claims and, and actions and without having a little more detail uh, I, I can't tell you exactly what your statute of limitations might be, but if you were injured in Illinois, uh, you're going to have a statute of limitation for that claim in Illinois. And if the question was about getting treatment in Kentucky and perhaps you think you got negligent treatment for that injury that you got in Illinois and the negligent treatment occurred in Kentucky, then you would have a different limitation for that. So it's probably best to check with a lawyer to get some detailed information and, and get a, a detailed answer. I have a question from another viewer who says, my husband was in a motorcycle accident recently and is ex expected to be off work for eight months. We're trying to settle the claim ourselves. Would it expedite things if we were to get a lawyer involved? Uh, it, it, it might or might not expedite things, but uh, certainly what it would do would be to uh, take a load off of uh, you and your husband. Uh, he's injured, he's uh, hurt, he's at home, and uh, if you're like most people, uh, you don't have experience trying to deal with something like this. You got your hands full trying to get better, take care of your husband. Uh, and uh, I think regardless of whether it would expedite things or not, uh, it would be best uh, to have it taken care of by a professional. So that, that'd be my best advice to you. Got about 90 seconds left in part two of today's Local 6 Legal Line, and we have a question from someone who says, my, uh, my son was a passenger in a vehicle that was involved in an accident about three months ago. However, they did not file a police report. Uh, his neck is evidently hurt. It's getting worse. Our medical bills are starting to pile up because of this treatment. Is it too late to file a claim? Uh, I would say it's not too late to uh, file a claim. Uh, the lack of an accident report could cause some problems, but it's not a bar to any claim. Uh, and so, uh, I, with, as was the advice to an earlier uh, questioner, uh, I think the sooner you get help, the sooner you get your claim filed, uh, the sooner you can start getting some of these things sorted out. So. Uh, now that you, uh, you know you need some help, I, I would get after it uh, sooner as opposed to later. The Honorable Kevin Shannon, our guest today on this edition of Local 6 Legal Live.